36 Storm Team Forecast. Independently certified, the most accurate in Central Kentucky. Unfortunately, we have not seen much sunshine this week. We've got more clouds outside and rain showers on the AIC roofing camera. The Fort Bain Skyview looking off toward Hamburg right now shows the overcast conditions. Fort Bain Skyview from EKU's campus. Same story except EKU not seen as much rainfall as they're seen around Lexington. Looking at a view from Cincinnati. Cincinnati has been dealing with some rain. You can kind of see off in the distance the Great American Ballpark. The Cincinnati Reds home opener was scheduled for tomorrow. They've now rescheduled that for Friday afternoon just after 4 o'clock against the Washington Nationals. Again, that's rescheduled for Friday just because they're expecting to have heavy rain tomorrow as well. Louisville, they've been dealing with the rain, but a little break in the activity around Louisville at this time. Live HD radar showing bulk of the activity is across the bluegrass region, south central, southeast Kentucky. A little break in the widespread rain. It's a little bit more hit or miss for you at this time. Two hour time lapse shows the showers are moving to the east to northeast. And this is relatively light rain, putting down about a tenth of an inch per hour. But many locations have already picked up over one inch of rain. You can see kind of some scattered showers around Stanton, Irvin, as well as over toward West Liberty. Areas like Jackson County, Casey, and Breathitt County all picking up about an inch or more over the past 24 hours. Just under one inch for Owsley County. Fayette uh, County picking up about three quarters of an inch. And then Madison County right around a half an inch of rain so far. Flood watches continue tonight through the day on Thursday and end by early Friday. For most of the viewing area, this flood watch is in effect. It does not include far southeast Kentucky. That's just because you may miss out on at least the heavier rain. Bigger picture, the current Current view right now. Low pressure system to our southwest, high pressure here off to our southeast. A lot of Gulf moisture being directed right over the region. We've got this stalled frontal boundary, which is the focal point for all this moisture to work its way right in over us as we continue overnight. Future cast here at 8 o'clock this evening up to midnight shows more rounds of this heavy rain moving through during our overnight hours with overnight lows in the lower 50s. Cool to start off your day on Thursday. You'll need the rain gear. It may not rain all day long, but we will have off and on rain showers all day long. And at times, it will be heavy rain. You can see here as we go into your Thursday afternoon, a little break in the activity here at 5 o'clock with upper 60s, but more rain moving back in here as we go into our Thursday evening around 8 o'clock into our overnight hours into Friday. Friday, it's not completely over with with the rain. Once again, a chilly start. Lower 40s may not see the rain as much earlier in the day, but more scattered showers here possible Friday afternoon with a cooler afternoon high of 52 degrees. Looking ahead to Easter weekend, a cold front will be moving through the area. There may be just enough colder air Sunday morning for the Easter Sunday morning. Yes, that we could see just a little rain snow mix possible across the area as temperatures will be cooling into the 30s by your Easter Sunday morning. So 6 o'clock here Saturday, rain showers developing overnight as we continue into your Sunday morning. The possibility for some of that colder air catching up with some of that rain and possibly giving us just a little wintry mix for the early morning hours of your Easter morning. And then by the afternoon, most of that rainfall fading away. Temperatures today, though, have been mild. Upper 50s to upper 60s across the local viewing area right now. Overnight lows in the lower 50s with more scattered rain showers again heavy rain at times tonight into Thursday upper 60s for Thursday Easter weekend 60 degrees Saturday Sunday we're at 50 degrees again more rain showers possible for late Saturday early Sunday and more rain chances even as we continue into next week all right so Easter Sunday is also April Fool's Day so you're kidding about I'm, all this I'm not right? kidding right now oh yeah. all right Sorry. thank you buddy well Brian Kennedy has sports coming up next